Welcome back guys, I am Telekinesis and we are playing Assassin's Creed Unity. This is part 6 and we just got an achievement, a cool little achievement. Look at that, we did some cool shit, we got achievement. Alright, I think there's going to be a cutscene here, so uh, let me stop talking and let's watch. Welcome back. Now that you've experienced life as an assassin, are you willing to pick up the fight and join us? Deacon, load the file. Coming up. We looked at a media file from Aftergo last month, and the information it contains is astounding. But we won't share these things with just anyone. By pressing play, you'll be joining the assassins. If you want to fight the Templar menace, if you're willing to save civilization from Abstergo's clutches, press play, sit back, and ready yourself for the truth. Good choice. Welcome to the Assassins, Initiate. In the 1950s, it was theorized that human DNA worked via the triple helix model. Some years later, the work of Crick and Watson demolished this theory in favor of the double helix. Today, we know the double helix to be indisputably the basis of all life. So why did the triple helix theory gain so much traction? Why did Rosalind Franklin's x-rays seem to confirm it? It turns out that their initial samples had been taken from small traces of precursor DNA, the rare genes of an ancient race embedded in our own. We now know that triple helix DNA is the foundation of the precursor genome. It is the genetic Rosetta Stone of our age. If we can crack it open, if we can sequence the full precursor genome, there is no limit to the knowledge we will gain. Using Animus technology, Precursor history will be open to us for the first time ever. Ancient languages will be unlocked, and ancient technology will be ours for the taking. Imagine what will be possible if we master the technology that underpins the pieces of Eden. Such discoveries would surpass 100-fold the splitting of the atoms. Last year, we located a rich sample of precursor DNA in a donor whose genes contained human and precursor DNA at an incredible 25 to 1 ratio. Our work will begin with this sample. Our goal is to unravel the triple helix, sequence the precursor genome, and change the world for the better, forever. Welcome to the Phoenix Project. So, this is where we stand. Last year, Abstergo acquired the body of a man we call a sage, one of a rare breed of humans with a surplus of ancient DNA. This sparked a search for more sages, in the present and in the past. The more Abstergo finds, the closer they get to their final goal. We've blocked their recent attempts to find more, but Abstergo will not stop looking until they sequence a full precursor genome. So, why Arno Dorian? Why chase an assassin through the French Revolution? It turns out, at some point in his life, Arnaud came into contact with another sage. We need you to find out when and where these meetings took place. If Arnaud was present for this sage's death, it might lead Abstergo straight to his body. Naturally, we'd like to find it first. This is where you come in. It won't be simple. Genetic memory must be tackled in sequence to keep the data stable. But we're confident you're up to the task. And you won't be alone. Other initiates, assassins just like you, are doing their part to end this fight. If you need more training, more experience, you can call on them for help. All right. Loading the next sequence. Data will have to increase your synchronization. 
All right, cool. So uh, let's go into the objective. Um, so we found out we can unlock some cool stuff. That is great. And uh, let's. Uh, wow, it's a lot of a uh, lot of people here, huh? So this objective is pretty far away, and uh, I think this is gonna be a, probably a training objective, one of those uh, training ones where you can just, you have to probably uh, kill, I think one or two people, just to prove yourself that you are an assassin. All right, let's get climb up on this building. Uh, what is all of this? I'm reading and climbing. <laughs> okay, let's go. Oh, somebody just shoot somebody? What? What is going on? Whoa. I almost fell. Wait, can I jump across? Can I do it? Can I? Come on. Oh, no, no. Oh, crap. I didn't make it. All right. All right. I'm playing like a noob. I got to stop playing like a noob. I'm playing like a noob. Let's go up. Come on, Arno. Your ancestors were better than this. You embarrass me. Oh, crap. He's slipping. I, I can't believe you can slip in this game. Wow. You can slip. Wow. That's uh, note to self. Not... Slip. All right, let's talk to this guy. Graduation. See, I told you. So after nearly a uh, year. Okay, fuck it. Fuck reading. What's the mission? Mission. Let's get your arse in position. Don't ask questions, piss pop. I live to serve. All right, so we just have to kill three people, not let the bell ring, and uh, cover three kills. So cover kills. I'm not gonna cover it. Uh, this is uh, this is pretty. Uh, it's not gonna be hard. It's gonna be easy, but I don't want to make it hard. Um, let's see what I can do here. Let me go to the other side because if you could jump down from here and try to take them on, it's not gonna be. It's gonna be a death wish. And in this game, the AI is really good. It is really good. They will they will try to get you right away. So um, hmm, let's go here. Let's uh, let's look around. What's the possibility here? So we got two guards there, and one guy's uh, on the right. That guy's looking straight at us, and we have to stab sabotage that bell. So let's get the guy that's all the way to the far right, and uh, let me see if I could get him. Try to be really uh, stealthy and see my surroundings. Dude, I have no. Uh, I don't have anything. Oh crap! What, what was that? All right, he's looking. See, I told you this AI is just, just wow. They're looking right at me. I don't know if it's a bug or they're just that fucking wow. See, look. So I hope they don't see me. I hope they don't see me. Let me kill this guy. Oh crap! He hit me. Up. And I stabbed him in his face. Okay, Arno is a violent, violent person. Let's loot this guy. My favorite part, I love looting. I don't know why, but I just love looting in this game. Well, any Assassin's Creed game, it's really fun. Okay, uh, so I'm gonna throw a smoke bomb and try to kill them right away because they're right next to each other. Let's see if this works. Okay, perfect. So they're kind of blinded. And he's done. And where are you going, sir? We're done. And that's it, that should be it. Yeah, that should be it. Is that it? Yes. Lord Guillaume de Roussel has generously agreed to our price of 40%. An act of desperation. What about the priest? You'll come around. <laughs> Your confidence is infectious, Sivert. My boys will have the weapon ready. Here are the details. Make sure it goes smoothly. Of course. Make sure that it goes smoothly, cretin. When have I... Murder! Murder! These bastards Help! always have bodyguards. Well... Well, so let's kill this guy. And... Next time, do that before that's it. he starts screaming. Why do let's we do hang about here when Sivet still lives? He killed Monsieur de la Serre. He killed hey, Monsieur de la Serre. He's Not acting today. a little pussy. Come on. Uh, are there more report. people coming? I think I saw somebody. Oh crap, there's more people coming. Uh, okay, so we have to use smoke. I've been using smoke bombs. Alright, um, so let's throw that smoke bomb and let's go kill him. 
All right, you know what? Let's run. Let's run. Hurry up. Oh, God. Nope. Let's run, I hope. Oh, no. They're ringing the bell. I hope I can keep up with this guy. Can I keep up with him? Can I keep up with him? Damn, this old man can run. All that parkour, man. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, where are you going? Where are you going? Come on. Uh, no, Arno, no. Oh, damn it. All right, we have to kill this guy. All right, cool. Let's go kill uh, kill those two. Wait, who's this guy? Wait, why is he running here? Wait, what? Who the? Is he one of the guys that I need to kill? What? Who is this guy? Where do you go? He's running from someone. Where's he going? All right, you know what? Leave him. Who's this guy? I'll come back later for him. Oh, he's running away from me. Oh crap! Nope, nope. Let's go get him. Oh, more kills, huh? He leaves us to do more kills. He's done, and this guy, and there's four more. I didn't even see that, so let's run away. That was not cool. That was not planned. Uh, where is he? Where is he going? He's still going, and there's probably two more in front of me. And I'm acting like a little noob right now. That's not cool. Three more here. Don't look at me. Hey, no. Where's he going, man? He's running away from me pretty far. Good. We got him. We, uh, we did it. Merde. Patriots. These imbeciles will pick a fight with anyone. Try not to draw their attention. Shouldn't we stop them? Stop them. Avoid them. Doesn't matter. There's always more fanags. Can't save everyone, Pisspar. Well, there's a cheery thought. Well, you can't save everyone. He's true in that. So let's not get caught. All right, extremists in uh, red harass the population. They are paid by Templars. They can recognize you and attack you anywhere in the city. Hmm. Something to uh, keep in mind. All right, let's follow this guy and keep in the shadows. Oh, okay. They know I killed somebody and they're acting stupid right now. Can I keep up with this guy? I think I can keep up with this guy. Damn, this guy is like, I have no idea where he's running, but I'm trying to keep up. I'll still be running when you're dead. Uh, I think that I think he speaks the truth. Oh shit! No, oh, I didn't even, I did not even expect that. Damn, where is he taking us? Better not be his, uh, better not be his love dungeon. Oh, why am I jumping? Oh, Arno, you are funny. Okay, he went inside the window. And I am not going there. You know what? F it. Let's go up. I think I can catch him better like this if I go my way and not follow him. I could jump the tree. There we go. There we go. Yep. Ah. Uh, oh, wait. Where is he going? Just trying not to strain your heart. And. Okay. Oh, see? I made it up to him. I just knew if, if I only knew where he was going, I could have caught him uh, faster. Why is he climbing this? Oh, no. Ah. You know what? I'll just take my way. Uh, excuse me. Thank you. Oh, where is he? He's going to the left. Uh, to the right now. Crap. And I can't walk up here? I can't. Okay, good. All right. Uh, there we go. Good. He's headed somewhere. Is it his, is it his hideout? Because it looks like it's probably Just his. Just trying not to strain your heart. Oh, should I fight them? Nah. Guards in blue always attack extremist. In red first, avoid attacking them to reduce conflict. You got it. You know he wants you to probably jump in the water. No, on the boat. Up! Oh, I knew it. His hideout. Need a break. There we go. I can't believe this. We've not seen Sea Bear for a year, and you're letting him walk, all because his name wasn't on a bloody piece of paper. The timing's not right. To fuck him talking. Good. Let's go. Oh, this uh, this looks like ah, my friend. Hello. You can replenish your twos and we, okay, he, so he's a shop guy. All right, cool. So he's a shop guy and he's every location. It's just clubs. Find good. 
Okay. So what happens next? We take this ledger full of Templar records to Mirabeau. Proceeds to do How are you, Fred? Hey, how are you too? You don't seem terribly fond of us. Templars have been killing each other like he was going out of fashion. He's himself as a great peacemaker. Civil war. He thinks he can end the war between assassins and Templars. Bring the revolution to a happy conclusion. Really? It's dogs and cats to live together in peace. What's this golden thing? And that's bad? Oh, that's my progression, okay. It's a self-aggrandizing pipe dream. Templars are at their weakest since Jacques de Malay burned. We're running around after second-rate smugglers. Well, the customs agents of France can rest easy. Arpinot's dead. Shaking down imprisoned nobles seems a bit out of his oeuvre. What are the Templars up to? If we hadn't spent the last year hobbled by your damned truce. We might know that. Here's a point, Honoré. The truce was with Grand Master de la Serre. The man's been dead for two years. Whoever's in charge now, you can be certain they aren't sitting idle. We might have learned more had we not allowed Sivert to escape. Sivert was there? I know your heart is set on keeping the peace, but bringing Monsieur de la Serre's killer to justice would count for something, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. But do not confuse your personal vendetta with a sound strategy. If he wants to kill Templars, let him kill Templars. I've done him all I can. Boys ready? Very well. Assassin. I charge you to go to Notre Dame and to find there the Templar agent Charles Gabriel Siver. You will learn his secrets, and when you have done so, you will bring him peace in accordance with our tenets. Cool, we just uh, passed the graduation, and now let's uh, continue on to part seven. That was pretty cool. Um, probably gonna do some changes on his stress and things like that. I'm gonna rate this memory. It wasn't that, I mean, it wasn't that good. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Please make sure to sub and like, thanks.